Hi friends, uh, good morning everyone. I hope all of you are doing good with your uh, job and personal life everywhere. And uh, if you came to our channel for the first time, click on subscribe button and hit the like button if you like the video and keep sharing our videos. So today's topic is, uh, I got uh, this question for um, in few discussions and all. During invoice verification, if you maintain that uh, tolerance limit for the price variance, if you maintain both the value and percentage, how can system identify which one needs to be considered? So system will consider the amount, the percentage amount or uh, fixed amount, which will hit first, means during the difference value, which will be the first priority. It means whatever the value will come as a So the value, which is the lowest value will be triggered first. That's what we can understand easily. So for example, let's go to the configuration, SPRO, SAP, reference IMG, material management, logistics, invoice verification. Here we have invoice block set tolerance limits. Directly also you can come, that is OMR6. Okay, so it's already open in another screen. Okay, I'll just close this. So set tolerance limits. These tolerance limits are maintained at the company code level. So I'm giving my company code GKCC and the price variance PP. Select that line and go to the details. See upper limit, I put absolute amount as 10. Here currency is rupees, so 10 rupees. And uh, limit is in percentage, it is 2%. Okay. How can system consider? System will consider which is the lowest value. For example, if 10 rupees is lowest, system will trigger for this. If 2% is lowest, then system will trigger this based on the percentage. Okay. Now we are going to test it so that you will get a better idea. Go to Miro and uh, give the date. Okay, I will give purchase order number. I will reference 64021 invoice party because the vendor is not an invoice party. It's a good supplier only. So system is asking to input a vendor which has the company code data. So this is the quantity and the amount. Okay, I'm going to increase the value of 80 rupees. Okay, I'm increasing the value of 80 rupees. 80 is more than 10 rupees. But 2% is what well if you consider for 30,000 value, the 2% is 600. Okay, now click on calculate tax. 35494.40. So still, now we can check on the messages. Okay. So, for example, here, what is the message? Amount check. Price is too high. Tolerance limit of 10 rupees, 10 INR exceeded. It's amount check. Okay. So, what system already verified that uh, tolerance limit is crossed? and it will block the invoice for the payment. Okay, that is after saving. But anyway, now the discussion point is system has verified 10 rupees. Now if you come here and uh, check this price variance, see here 10 rupees is the lowest one compared to 2%. 2% is around 600 rupees and value we have given as 10 rupees. So system has verified this amount check. Now what will I do? I will keep do not check. No need to check an absolute amount. You only check two percentages. Now I have saved this configuration. Now go to the same purchase order. Okay. I am going to close the screen. Now we'll go to Miro again. Input the date, input the reference number. 
input the P1 number. Okay. Once you input the P1 number, system uh, will copy the details from the purchase order, amount, quantity, purchase order number, item, all the information are copied. So now what I'm going to do, let me give the same 80. Okay. So calculate tax. Actually, we don't have to do all those things. Even in the message itself, we can see it. Okay. But anyway, we'll do that primary part so that you will get an idea. 35494.40. Okay. Now you go to messages. See here, just the invoice part related data is there. There is no message about the crossing because it is still in two percentages. Now, what will I do? I will make this 800. Calculate tax. Okay. So this is 36344. Now go to messages. See here. Price too high, tolerance limit of 2% is exceeded. So we have put only percentage. So system has uh, verified only the percentage. And um, until 2% is crossing, system has not verified that amount check. So based on this testing, what we understood, if you maintain the both the values in your tolerance limit, system will hit based on the lowest value, which is the lowest value system will hit that amount check and the block that invoice for the payment. Okay, if you're keeping only percentage, it will check based on the percentage. So generally, uh, this both will not be maintained, mostly either percentage, two percent, three percent, whatever business will maintain. In both the cases are maintained means uh, still business wanted to have that one. We are okay for two percentage always, but the amount should not cross thousand rupees, other hundred dollars or ten dollars, whatever the amount still they wanted to keep as a threshold amount, they can use it. Okay, I hope you understand the difference between uh, absolute amount and percentage. If both are maintained to check the limits, how system will behave, system will hit based on the lowest value. If you like the video, hit the like button and keep sharing with your SAP friends. Good luck with your future endeavors. Thank you.